It's gone now. No! I actually did beat her. True. I don't know if you saw Hand that. Hand it to Weston now, because you died. So that's one bar of life dead. How many bars does she have? Can you tell? Um, I'm going with... She has this one and one more. Oh. It might not be that she was paralyzing you. It might be that we're too far away to the center to pick up our controller sometimes. No, you could see him, like, wobbling around. Ah, could you? Yeah. Spirit gems re reappear every time Cinder or Spyro dies. However, Cinder and his current health bar also becomes reclaimed. So we need that. Die, Cinder! We'll be friends someday! You can quick dodge, apparently. How? And she just totally threw me off a cliff. Not cool. <laughs> I I'll give you another chance. Uh, I don't know. Should, uh, Isaac be the judge. Does Weston get another try? Okay. What, do you not want to? I don't know, but if we start bending rules, then... Yeah, but that wasn't <laughs> really entirely because she killed you. It was because you... I mean, she did knock you off, but like, what? if you fall off or she knocks you off, I feel like it shouldn't count as a death. Oh, man. I want her Unless to you were able to get her health to like, within like 20% of it being down, then then the other person gets to try. Alright. See, so one full mana bar of us gets her down halfway. Yeah. With the green thing. The green thing is actually quite powerful. Oh. See, she like disorients you a little bit. Yeah, I'm not sure what's up with that. I don't know. Don't throw me off a cliff, Cinder. Hold a little. Yeah, you almost like knock yourself off the cliff and breaking those. Yeah. Two Chris. Oh, your man is replenished, by the way. Oh, that's nice. I want more help. Cinder, land real quick. Where is she? <laughs> like, she's scaring me. <laughs> Thank you for blowing your shadowy fire crap it's over there. It's fire. You can deliberately entirely tell it's fire. Yeah. Maybe it's really poison. It's just red. Let's go with that. But it's not. It's fire. Like, you yeah. can't mistake that for anything. Before. It could be The only be thing shadow. you can mistake it for is, is fury. Or not fury. Um, fear? Is, is that what it was called? Yeah, I could see that. Die, Cinder! By the way, you can hold B. That's not as fun. <laughs> True. Don't do that. Come on, just stay weak. What are you doing that for, Cinder? Oh, maybe she's... Nope, she's not dead. Oh, thank you for healing me, Cinder. Oh, I'm moving sideways now, and I can't move forward. That's cool. Really? Yeah. Also, I'm shooting this. I am not sure. Now no, and it seems to hurt her quite well. The true I do not know what's going on here. Care to tell me how to do that? She's dead, by the way. I know, but someone wants me to unleash a true, true dragon inside me. Click Z. I seem to do the job. Or kill me. Um. So, should I look up how to unleash the true dragon within us? <laughs> yeah. Um. Add one angry dragon. Quickly dodge after firing each blast. Uh. You can only dodge so far one way. By the way. Unleash a massive fury attack strike that send. Yeah. So try Z. <laughs> Maybe I just didn't do it soon enough. Jeez, dude, she's very accurate with her bombs. Oh, yeah. Man, I did better at this than you just saying. It's time to unleash the true dragon within you. Uh, I think it must be Z. Yeah, that's right. Ah, seems like he's getting the job done. Ooh, that's pretty. Little Spyro faces. <laughs> Suck my face. Like, you just gave Cinder, like, a bazillion kisses. 
Mm, 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 mm. It's okay, they end up mm, being mm, lovers anyway, so that's fine. Oh yeah, they're dragon lovers. She'll think back on this moment fondly. <laughs> you sure? <laughs> I wouldn't. <laughs> well, it is the moment where I believe that she stops becoming a dark dragon. Uh, maybe. So, not only did I save her, but I gave her like 18 kisses. Uh, more than 18. <sighs> so like much 30. more than 18. <sighs> is just like me. Ha! See, she's black Dude, in this we gotta one. get out of here now. I, I can't leave her she's behind. She's not dark purple. I've got to save her. So what? Save the beast that's been trying to kill us? You're yeah, making the right choice, Spyro. Fault. She was being used by the Dark Master. Might want to chop... Chip chop this up, Spyro. Hurry up. No. Get with the program. Or go no, into a uh, evil right void. That's cool too. What a nice guy. Like she shrunk and then Spyro's like, oh she's kinda cute now. She's actually <laughs> like black in this one, which I enjoy. In the yeah third one she's more of a dark purple and they always call her black and it bugs me as you can tell from our playthrough of it yeah mommy fluff my pillow yeah she's like legitimately black yeah <laughs> feeling better spider <laughs> oh, what really would nice. you do without you <laughs> that battle drained every last bit of everything my except without the witty I can hardly lift my head True. yes it would take some time for your powers to return but they will in time, young dragon. They will in time. Cinder, ever since I failed the night of the raid, I've dreamt of this day. It wasn't just you, Ignitus. We all failed. Be that as it may, we're together again now. Thanks to Spyro. You're all failures. Yeah. Well done. If it's all their fault, young dragon. <laughs> they should have done better. Thanks, Ignitus. But we still don't know what's happened to the Dark Master. No matter, Spyro. There will be time to talk of the Dark Master later. Now it's time to be grateful for your success. His success? Hey, what about me? Just because a bunch of weird stuff doesn't Maybe fly out of my mouth doesn't mean I didn't help you. Maybe she becomes less black because she yeah, becomes you, like... Yeah, you were a, a big help, Sparks. No doubt about mm -hmm. it. But just for the record, a lot of weird stuff does come out of that little mouth of yours. And what the heck is that supposed to mean? You know, I don't need this. I could have stayed with the <laughs> llama people, whatever, where I was appreciated, but no. No, I just had to help the poor, helpless dragons rid the world of evil. What a mistake <laughs> that was, because I get no thanks. No respect, no love, no credit. My goodness. <laughs> and I thought Voltaire talked a lot. I left home too, you know. I'm a little guy, yeah, that's right. Maybe you haven't noticed. <laughs> Things are a lot bigger to me than they are to you. And did I back away? Uh-uh. Nah, nah, nah. Why? Because I got moxie. I'm a tough cookie. I got class. <laughs> I got a, <clears throat> a little frog in my throat. Uh, as I was saying... At the very end of the book, it says the legend continues. They they so I still the think there's something else coming quality out. Quality dragonfly like You me. think so? Yeah. But here I, I don't know. nothing. Uh, I did don't that. watch it, it'll ruin it. Doing? Good. Let me buy you no, I'm just... I should go back to the swamp. Mom will make it all good. Small Cinder hasn't spoken yet, Mommy has she? No. She might be a mute. We heard her voice a little bit when she was shrinking. And it did become more... better. More nice, happy girl yeah. instead of evil witch. Okay, credits. so here are the credits. Um, I figure... I think there's going to be something at the end of them. So there I figure... I figure there. we can just talk about how we enjoyed the game while credits roll, and then if we really want to, we can skip some of it when editing. Yeah. Is that a giant hamburger? What? what? Give me that. All right, so. Spoiler alert. This portion of the guide reveals all of the game's unlockable secrets and bonus content. Don't read the section if you don't want to ruin the surprise, because we were totally able to. Ultimate Fury Attacks. By <laughs> spoilers, apparently. Yep. Um, by fully upgrading Spyro's uh, primary and secondary breath abilities in any one category, 
Ice Fire, you gain you gain access to one of his ultimate fury attacks. Um, these are far more powerful than Spyro's secondary fury attacks. Easily capable. We didn't even know that. Yeah. <laughs> Completed game save. When you beat the game, and with the help of this wonderful guide, you will. Uh, <laughs> wonderful um, guide. <laughs> Quotation Spyro's marks. end of game status is automatically saved to you. Uh, load this uh, game. Save to play through from the start again with all of the breath ability Spyro learned. Oh, that's nice. Yeah. Um, Elijah Wood interview. Once you beat the game, the extras option appears in the main menu. Uh, select this option to watch the cool interview with Elijah, Elijah Wood, which is the uh, voice actor of Frodo, if anyone was, was wondering. Also Spyro. And Spyro. The voice of Spyro. Um, and then credits. Finally, uh, you can also watch the end of game credits through the extras menu. <laughs> if you want to watch this more times. Uh, just in case you miss them the first time. And that's all the that's all of it. Oh, such spoilers. Yeah, so I figured it would have something about something being at the end of the credits if it didn't. You know? Yeah. But I don't know. Um, so how do you like this game at? I enjoyed it. I would mm. say it's a pretty good game. I enjoyed it. There were a couple spots that were like, Are you serious? Yeah, just, oh yeah. just dumb. But overall, I enjoyed it. I'd give it a solid seven. Yeah. Do we want to watch? I mean, obviously, we won't record it. If you want to watch the interview with Elijah Wood, then you'll have to play the game and beat it on your own. Um, but do we want to watch it? Sure. Uh, just because I feel like that's something that we'll get in trouble if we put into a video. Not necessarily. Yeah, but... We could give us some commentary about Elijah Wood. Well, yeah, I feel like it'd be better. Because then they get the experience of playing the game. And then oh, they'll yeah. actually have some reference. They'll, they'll, yeah. they'll have their own experience with the game. So at the end, when Sparks was talking about the Llama people, I felt like that was a reference to Emperor's New Groove. Because it's a movie about llamas. <laughs> Could have been. Like, I don't know when this game was made. So. Uh, like, Just when he said Llama, it made me think of that movie and it made me laugh. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's kind of funny. Llama. Yeah, but... All in all, I would give this game about an 8 out of 10. I'd give the guide, like, maybe a like 3 or a 4. <laughs> I was going to say, like, a 2. A 2? Mm. Yeah, it's not a great guide. It does have some parts where it's slightly helpful, but not yeah. enough parts for it to be useful. Yeah. I honestly didn't know the guide was coming with the game when I bought it, so that was a happy surprise, but... Yeah, from what I understand, a lot of the times, uh, if, it, like, if it's been taking a long time through eBay... Did you buy it through eBay? Yeah. They'll if it takes if they, it takes them too long to send it. Sometimes they'll send you free stuff. Yeah, like well, this it was actually in the listing. I just didn't pay close enough attention. Oh. So, yeah, but I had someone who rented a wig. I heard about someone who rented a wig. Like they told me this story. Yeah. Um, and it took like a month wow. and a half to get it sent to them. Wow. But they got they got epic music. Um, they got the wig, they got like things that are special that you put on your head under the wig or something. They got like two of them. They got a, a wig brush. They, got, wig they brush. got like some makeup kits when they were only supposed to get the wig. Really? Yeah, and it was all because they... Oh, that's kind of nice. Them. Yeah. Like that's the I sign of a good eBay seller. Yeah, the one it's... time that uh, something took me um, like two two months. No, it took me like a month and a half to get almost. Is that the Harvest Moon game? Yeah, Harvest Moon 64. The guy sent it to the wrong address or something. No, he, he didn't write a W on it or something. Yeah, it's, he says he didn't write a W on it, but I don't care who you say. It, it'll it'll still get sent to me if you don't write a W. And sometimes the post office is really anal. I've, I've, had it, I've, had, I've had things sent to me without stuff like that before. On yeah. it. it just depends on the post office. I just think the guy was stupid. Um, and then... You know, and then even after he said, okay, I'll get it fixed, it still took like a week and a half to two weeks to send it to me. Yeah. When originally it was only supposed to take like a week to send to me. Yeah. You know, after that. Oh, be quiet. Basically, he wasn't a good eBay seller, by the way. <laughs> I said be quiet. See anything, Spyro? No. But I've got a bad feeling. Me too. No, it's the same voice.
Oh. I like the voice actor for Cinder a lot better in the uh, third game. Yeah. She seems a lot more friendly. I wonder if maybe in the second game, you play it as both like Spyro and Cinder. You just kind of switch off or something. It's a possibility. Because I feel like I it'd be know. weird for them to just throw Cinder in. Maybe in Cinder one. is in like therapy. Because if I wonder, if I wonder when that, I'd go into therapy. <laughs> Yeah, because her entire life she was spent that way. Basically. Yeah, but it's a video game. You can't, you can't, you know. <laughs> um, may or may not be therapy in some video games. <laughs> yeah, it's like during the loading screen, all the main characters are going pee. <laughs> yeah, that's really what you're waiting for when you load. Like yeah, Skyrim, they, they have, they really have to pee. <laughs> yeah, they they. They're peeing, they're pooping, they're vomiting, they're doing everything. Oh, man. yeah. All the same time. Yeah. It's like a... <laughs> Their body is just exploding <laughs> of of bodily fluids and yeah. excrements. Fluids coming out of every orifice. Everything, man. Oh. Uh, yeah. You, you, don't just, you don't just recover after something like that. You gotta sit there for like four or five minutes. Yeah. That's why it takes so long. <laughs> um, well... I, I actually saw a video game, Deadpool. Yeah. You will actually do pee in the video game. Really? Yeah. Like, do you actually have like a bladder, and then you have to pee occasionally? No, but you can go pee every once in a while. Oh, that's kind of fun. <laughs> yeah, that, that's it. Like, I think that'd be a cool feature for games like Halo. Ah, oh, <laughs> pee. It's no. impeding my aiming ability. <laughs> I feel like for Halo that wouldn't be a good idea. Yeah. But if but if my uh, other group of friends ever decides to go into video game making, I'll tell them it's a feature they should add into one of their games. Oh yeah. Like, okay. All right. Well, that's pretty much it. Yeah, that was our playthrough of The Legend of Spyro, A New yep. Beginning. And if anyone was wondering, I did just read that right off the main screen so I didn't mess it up. Good job. Um, so here we were, um, Dawn Fable and Verbal Pants 6. Yep. Um, Isaac's... Nope. Not Isaac's little brother. Weston's little brother. Isaac. Um, I'm not sure if after this we'll have any more recordings with Verbal in them. Yeah. Because... The Herbal. next couple times we'll be hanging out, we'll be doing other stuff. We'll be like, doing real stuff instead of video games. <laughs> yeah, and then after that he leaves. Yeah. So Going to Mexico. Um. So I might. Uh, so after that, it'll be it'll be sad and I'll miss him yeah. ent entirely. He's gonna cry a little next time he does a video. Yeah. I'll just be. I'll just be playing. I'll be. Like, <laughs> Uh, I miss Verbal Pants because he's the best. <laughs> yeah. So, um, as it says in one of our uh, descriptions, I oh yeah, I didn't realize <laughs> until after I looked at the video on my phone two days after we uploaded it. Yep. Yeah. So today we'll try to maybe get some other videos uploaded. Um, to any of our two subscribers at the current moment, we love you two subscribers. Yeah. Props to you guys. You know, we love all you other subscribers Hopefully. too, but the first two have a special place in our hearts. Actually, I, I would say the first. First about five to ten. Know. Well, the first two are the first we mentioned, so they're the automatically the superior. They do. I, I will lie. They have like a special place in, our, in, in my heart, at least. Yeah, you can't deny it. You just feel attached to them in a special way. One, one or both of them may or may not be female, but at the same time, if you're they male, might both be male. So If you are male, we'll talk, we're talking about the other one. Yeah, so any... By the time this video comes out... Hopefully we'll have a lot more subscribers. Yep. Um, and then it'll just be a shout out to those two. Yep. Um, yeah, but I guess that's all for uh, today. I'm motioning Weston to go turn <laughs> off the video. Goodbye. So it'll just end into not us not talking for a whole minute. So goodbye. Next, see you next time and whatever we make.